Hey guys, in this video, we're going to take a look at how you can quickly rearrange home screen icons or widgets on the home screen on your iPhone 13 or the iPhone 13 Pro or the Mini or the Pro Max. So you can see here at the moment, my screen is quite cluttered with icons and apps in one widget. So if you want to rearrange the icons on the home screen, let's say I want to bring this FaceTime down to the bottom. So the first thing that you want to do is touch and hold on the icon or an app that you want to move, touch and hold. And then you can see once you start to touch and hold, once it is in edit mode, you can then start to drag the icon to a different location on the screen. So go to where you want to place them. So let's say if I want to drop it on this fourth row right here, let go. And that will push the other item to the first position. And then now you can place uh, the FaceTime items down here. Okay, so again, if you want to move camera down to the second row, so how this screen is organized is by grids. So you've got the first row, second row, and you've got the third, fourth, fifth, and sixth row, and then you've got columns. Okay, so let's say I want to move the camera to the second row on the first column. You simply just have to touch and hold and then drag it to where you want to place them and let go. And that's how you can rearrange um, the icons. Now similar to widgets, you can just simply touch and hold on the widget and then drag them to where you want to place them on the screen. And you can see it here. Now this widget takes up two rows. So every time you move it, it will move two rows at a time. Depending on the size of your widget, uh, there are many uh, different size. Uh, we've got the small one, which is a small uh, square. Takes up around f um, four icons or uh, four slots in the grid. And this one here takes up uh, two rows. Then you've got a larger one, which uh, takes up uh, four rows and four columns. And that's it. Okay, so another thing that you can do is if you want to organize your home screen so that it looks neat and tidy, is you can um, create folder so you can drag one icon and then uh, stack them on top of another icon and in here when you do so it will start to create a folder okay so you can see if I try to place them on top it will uh, create a folder so uh, let's do it again so let's say I want to create a camera and a clock to get it in one folder if I want to put them together in one folder I would uh, drop them in like that and automatically based on the type of app the folder automatically has a name this one here say photography because we place a camera in this folder so the folder automatically iPhone automatically suggests a name for a folder now if you do not like the the, the name suggestions uh, from Apple you can simply uh, delete that suggestion and write in your own name uh, so example my tools Okay, I'm just going to name it my tools folder and that's it. So now we can tap on done and then tap outside. And so now I have uh, created a new folder called my tools with two apps in it. Okay, so you can place uh, a number of different apps into the same folder so that you can better organize your home screen. And if you want to delete the folder, all you have to do is simply uh, remove. You can tap on remove folder like so. And let's say that we move my tools. We're moving from home screen. We'll keep all apps from the folder in your app library. So basically, if you delete the folder, it will delete all the shortcuts uh, in this folder. And if you want to find your apps again, you need to go to your app library to bring it back onto your home screen. Otherwise, if you don't want to lose all the shortcuts in that folder, then you will have to move them out of the folder one by one like this. Okay, so go back into the folder and we'll move them uh, one by one. So move them out one by one until there's only one item left in there. And once you have done that, so actually you need to move all them out to delete the folder. And then tap on the done button when uh, once you have half finished. And that's it. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel for more videos.